Well, that was pretty funny, actually. I thought that. <laughs> <laughs> Mike Holmgren was mad at me. He thought I planted that Sharpie in T.O. Sock. So, Who did? Mike Holmgren was the coach over there. That's my mentor, right? He right. was mad at me. And, and so on the, I didn't know about the Sharpie in the sock. Look at me. I'm like Marshall Falk. I don't wear socks today. Right. And so, um, so I didn't learn about it till the press conference. So you go, hey, what about T.O. that pulled a Sharpie? You go, what? Because I didn't. I'm not looking at T.O. after he scores. I'm getting guys. We're going for two. Yeah. And so... Um, he just stops on the bus uh, on the bus on the way to the airport because we were at Seattle. Tio's back there. I'm right here, and I said, "Stick around. Let everybody get off. I want to talk to you." So, so everybody gets off to go to the plane. So it's me and it's Tio, and I turn around. I go, Tio, did you really pull a sock out of, uh, a sharpie out of your sock? <laughs> he went, mm "Hmm." I go, "Hmm." Who gave you the sharpie? I'm not telling you that. <laughs> <laughs> so he didn't want to throw it to this day. Do you know who uh -uh, the sharp? Uh -uh, he won't tell me. <laughs> the first time he did it, I didn't see it because I'm not watching him go to the star. I'm getting high fiving guys. I'm getting the the field goal team or the extra point team on the field. That kind of thing. And then the first time I realized it is when Emmett Smith scored a touchdown. And then all of a sudden he ran. He ran to the half court, mm -hmm. he took his helmet off, and he took the ball, and he went, boom, and he was looking at me. And I'm going, he's looking at me. What's he looking at me for? <laughs> and Shuggy up in the box goes, well, he's doing that because T.O. went to the star. I went, what? He says, yeah, T.O. went to the star on his touchdown, so Emmett did, went to the star on his touchdown. I'm going, what's going on? Anyway, so we just keep – Kid playing the game, and then we throw another touchdown pass. We beat him. We beat him good. Anyway, we, he throws another touchdown pass to T.O. Mm -hmm. on a fade, a little F-short motion fade. It was pretty good. And then he goes to the star again, and then George Teague. I'm going, oh, my God. Here comes George Teague. I used to have him over in Green Bay. He was on our team. And then here comes Derek Deese, and he's going to start fighting. And what you'll see Deese come into the picture here. Mm -hmm. And right here, there's Deese. He's nuts, too. And, and so I'm going... <laughs> This is going to be a team brawl, man. This is the, I can't stand this. And so that's what caused our little rift. With you and T.O. Oh, yeah. Because you had you had to address it. When did you address it with him? In when? the locker room after. What would you say to him? Oh, man. We won 41. Look at that. 41. To, I don't know what. We beat him pretty good. Mm -hmm. um, and... And I, and I said, we're not going to play that way. That We are not going to win that way. We're not going to lose that. We are not going to play. Because I took it I took it as being, you know, showboating and, you know, really maybe causing a bench-clearing brawl, yeah. obviously. <laughs> yeah. And he didn't look at it quite like that. Anyway, so I suspended him without pay for the week. Kicked him out of the and building. And then your relationship was never the same. We made a mistake there. You know why? Because mm -hmm. I did it. I did it. You know, I just wanted to be the coach, and I said it. This is going to be my decision. He's he's suspended. the The club should have did it. the The ownership or the or management should have done that. So when he comes back, I can have a relation, coach player relationship with the guy, right? Instead of friction. So we had friction from then on out. For more Rich Eisen show, tune to Audience Channel two thirty nine on Directv or download the Rich Eisen show app.